Morning. Morning. Well, look with everything today. Thanks. Wait, are you not getting up to cook me the most amazing breakfast to make sure I nailed this interview? No, the milk's gone off. Love you. <sighs> Love you too. Run out of shampoo. Just wait here. But yeah, there's someone here for an interview. Mm -hmm. Colin Simmons. <laughs> I don't care. Just get rid of this complete and utter bore. Colin Simmons, yes, you look great. Do you work out? Well, I, uh... uh yes. Oh, yes, come with me. Come, come, come. So, you have experience, yes. Yes, of course you do. And uh, you like my show? Well, yes, yes, sure you do. So the real question is, Colin, do I like you? Well, yes, yes, I think I do. Now tell me, what do you envision for my show? Well, as I mentioned in our last email, your ideas sound very interesting. Ah, yes, yes, oh yes, I completely understand why you'd say that, yes. Well, yes, I can imagine your show questioning all of reality TV. It brings into question whether our current version of reality TV really is reality. In this age, it'll be especially inspiring to young people to see what relationships are actually like. Well, I think an inspiration to all people, don't you? It'll grip the nation, yes? People will rob shopkeepers at knife point and uh, loot televisions just to watch it. It'll be bloody brilliant, yes? An inspiration to everyone. Right. Hmm? Anyway, uh, I'd be incredibly honoured and excited to work on this project with you. Really look forward to see how it grasps the attention of mm -hmm. everyone. Well, yes, 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 you are perfect, Colin. I have a vision and I am sure that you will deliver. Thank you, sir. I'm looking forward to meeting the team. Perfect. We begin filming tomorrow at 6.45 sharp. And uh, please, don't call me sir. 6.45 p.m.? 6.45 p.m.? <laughs> no, no, goodness. 6.45 a.m., yes, in the beautiful sunny morning. The most perfect time of day, yes? Well, you mentioned filming. What exactly are we filming? The show, of course. The young couples as they fall deep in romantic love and try to work out how the rest of their lives are going, yes? We're all very romantic. <laughs> What about pre-production, shot list, storyboards, oh, makeup, yeah. don't, prop, don't, don't, I haven't no, even seen the equipment. No, 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 we don't need any of that pointless fabrication, yes? You see, Colin, that is the beauty of reality TV. You can just turn up and see what happens, yes? We're looking for vivid imagery, real people doing real things in real life, yes? Unless they go breaking up or something like that. No, no, we're looking for a more romantic edge. Okay, then, well, I... I look forward to yes. tomorrow. I hope oh, everything yes. is all yes, done. Yes, yes, yes. So you turned up then? What? Can't blame me for hoping another completely incompetent filmmaker wouldn't turn up. Yeah. Well, I'm here now, so I appreciate if you mind your own business, let me do my job. Um, hi. Oh, hello. I take you're the new head of cinematography. I'm yeah. Sally, project manager. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Don't mind the cameras. Um, Pierre Leaft had the opportunity of having his work filmed from behind the scenes. So you've met Adam already. Um, have you had the normal reaction? Yeah, is he alright? 
he's not very happy that Pierre didn't make him the director of photography, but Pierre wouldn't do that. He knows Adam's useless, and he knows that we know that Adam's useless, so... Why does he keep him around, then? You've met Pierre, haven't you? Um, Adam might not have the skills required for filming, but he has other qualities that Pierre admires. Oh my god, that is hilarious, darling! <laughs> Something's come up. I'm afraid I'm going to have to call you back. Yes, uh, hugs, kisses, mwah, mwah, mwah. goodbye. Sally? Oh. Sally? Hi, what is it? Um, yes, can you explain to me why the are in makeup? This is reality, woman! Get it cleaned off. No, 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 fire her, then get it cleaned off. Now, my two lovelies. Oh, it is time for you to meet some very important people, yes? Everybody, we are all here. To, we are all here together as one big happy film crew family. Yes, but if we are the parents of this family, then who are our children? Hmm? It is now my pleasure to introduce to you Thomas and Hannah. Are they not perfect? Um, you know, actually, I prefer Tom. Oh, such a joker, no? Anyway, over the next few weeks, Thomas and Hannah are going to be starring in our show, and... Oh! Oh, please forgive me, I've been terribly rude. Colin here is also new to the crew. Everyone give him a big hand. I'm going to make you feel very welcome on set here. If there's anything you need, come and let me know. In the meantime, um, Sally, I'm sure we'll show you around, show you the ropes, that sort of thing, yes? Excellent, yes. I'll see you around, yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, Colin, um, you are family now, so if there's anything you need, just let me know. Good morning, everybody. Ah. Quiet on set, please. Everybody, stop what you're doing and look at me. Right, today, my lovelies, we're filming the picnic scene with the gorgeous Hannah and Thomas, yes? And it's bloody freezing outside, so I want to get this done quickly. If I hear a peep out of anyone who should not be peeping, I will not be happy. Right? Yes? Understood? Good. Okay, so, roll sound. Well, I'm getting a buzzing sound from on set. A what? A buzzing sound? Can we, can we turn something off? Right, yes, how about, is that, is that okay? Yeah. You all had a briefing, yes? Turn your phone off! That him goes for the rest of you. Now, can we please get this show on the road? I'm still getting a buzzing sound, sorry. <sighs> Christ's sake! Come on, let's be professionals here. Roll the sound. Sound rolling. Camera rolling. Camera speed. Clapper. Clapper. Huh? Clapper? Gazumo! Huh? What? Oh, good heavens! This is stamp here, gentlemen, we do something! Oh my god! Oh, <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> no! <laughs> Going? <laughs> no, my boy! <laughs> no! The gazebo is dead. We cannot work in these conditions, not without our gazebo. It's over. Go home, everyone! Go home!
Pierre, oh, hello. I'm sorry to interrupt. Could you tell me a little bit more about your vision? What are we actually doing here? My vision, Colin, is that there is no vision, yes? No scripts, no storyboards, no false imposing misrepresentations of reality, yes? See, audiences around the world are being spoon-fed drivel. And I am here to open their eyes. So, what are we actually filming today? A picnic. A picnic? Inside? Isn't that a bit fake? Not to mention, look at the weather, it's beautiful oh, yes, today. Yes, we did try to do it outside, Colin, as I'm sure you'll remember. It was a complete disaster, yes? My poor gazebo. So, what are they going to actually do on this picnic? Why, don't they just sit down and eat picnic things? No, I understand that, but where are we going with this? That's the whole point, Colin, nobody knows, yes? We go wherever our couple go. The actors are given no lines, no direction, no help whatsoever, yes? It'll be the world's first proper reality TV show. Yeah, a picnic inside is reality. Well, there has to be some impetus, of course. But other than that, it's completely organic, yes? It'll be perfect, it'll be genius. Don't you worry about it. Right, let's get ready to film. Where's my clapper? Clapper? Clapper! Come on, clapper man, clap! Valentine's, scene six, act one, take one. No! It's Valentine's. As in time. Yes? Do it. Christ, okay. Action! It's such a nice day, isn't it? How's work? Mm, we had our office meeting in the morning. There's a new guy starting in a few days. Is he cool? Well, he's good looking. Oh yeah, because that's all you need, right? Cut! Excuse me. Okay, my lovelies. You're doing great. Um, I think maybe we should try this again, but uh, this time, a little bit more romantic, yeah? My vision is there is no vision. <laughs> well, everybody needs some guidance, yes? Shall I continue? You're looking beautiful today. Is that a new dress? What? No, I've had it ever since that Christmas you bought it for me, but thank you. Uh, yeah, right. So, anyway, are you enjoying your picnic? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's yummy. Thanks. It's my pleasure. You know I do everything to make you happy. <laughs> yeah, right. That's why you got that tattoo last week. Oh, come on. It was a tiny tattoo. I wanted it for ages. I've got no issue with you getting the tattoo, but why there? So no one sees it. I see it. Cut! Sorry, um, what tattoo? The tattoo of a lady. Oh, very nice. He's such a romantic, no? It's not me. Hey, how do you know? I told you my tattoo artist is crap. She's Korean. I think we should see it. Yes, that's a good idea. I think you should get it out. Yes, have a look. It's on my bum. It's on his bum. Oh. Oh, well, in that case, never mind. Carry on. What are we even doing here, Tom? Is this what our relationship has come to? Reality TV? Have I stopped making you happy? What? No, you, you know I love you, right? Me too, but what if that's the only thing we have left in common? What if that's not enough? What are you trying to say? Do you ever miss when we were just friends, when we weren't trying to be people we were not. I mean, look at us, we're staring in some pathetic reality TV show because we can barely make ends meet, and all we ever do is fight. Yeah, I guess, I don't want to pretend anymore, but I mean, I love you more than anyone in the world, but I'm never going to be who you want me to be. I, I miss our friendship, Tom. Yeah, uh, I miss it too. Is it over? I think so. Cut! No! You are not breaking up! You're not! No, no, no! no.
I think we all got a bit too excited just then. You two, my lovelies, I need you to imagine that all of these cameras and crew, they're not here, yes? You wouldn't be breaking up without all the pressure. Let's all take a deep breath, and we'll begin again in ten minutes' time. Well, don't just stand around, go, have a break, get a coffee, do some yoga, get a Brazilian if you must. Yeah, right, a Brazilian. As if we're gonna get a flight to Brazil in ten minutes. Idiot. <sighs> right, okay, break's over. Now we've all calmed down, it's time to get back on with what we're supposed to be doing. So, um, what exactly are you wanting from us now, Pierre? You want to play ourselves or for the people? Well, you're playing yourselves, of course. Mm. This is reality TV. Right, so you want us to try break up? No, 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 You haven't broken up, see? Bowie. Colin! I think we need to discuss the camera work, yes? We <laughs> for a more natural approach. Right, what do you suggest? Handheld cameras, yes? Handheld cameras everywhere. I can try and work with that, but don't you think it might look a bit amateur? It's reality, reality, reality. <laughs> I know it's been an interesting day, but it will all work out in the end. Can I help with anything? Um, Pierre asked me to use handheld cameras. How literally do I take him? Well, for now, for our own sakes, just do everything he says. If he asks you to shine his shoes or brush his teeth, just just do it, because otherwise we'll all go crazy. Well, I've never seen anything like it. People just don't seem to be able to take instructions. Yes, well, no, no, I tried telling them that. They're just not on my level. Yes, no. No, I've, I've got to go now. Everything's, everything's uh, wrapping up. Okay, hugs and kisses, take care of yourself. Mwah, 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 mwah. Bye bye. Yes, bye, bye, bye. Hey, Pierre, oh. I was wondering if I could have a second. Yes, sure. I feel like the crew don't really know what they're doing. I wonder if I could have a few days, maybe three, just to get them up to speed so we can, you know, deliver the vision to the quality you deserve. Colin, I quite frankly love my crew, yes? And if you think you're above us after working on set for how many days now, then fine, you keep on thinking that. That does not give you the right to take my family away from me for three days, okay? You have them this afternoon. They'd better be noticeably more adequate when you come back. Everyone, everyone gather around. Colin here has taken it upon himself to teach you all how to do your jobs. You have him this afternoon, and tomorrow there better be a noticeable improvement. Thank you very much. Good day. Simon, Adam, we've got one afternoon to learn how to use this stuff properly. Come on, bring me the camera, let's get started. Find out where Simon is with my coffee. Oh, Jesus, Adam, what's wrong with you? Give me that. Attention everyone, stop what you're doing and listen to me. Our cute little break is over and now it is time to get this show back on the road. Today we're going to be filming Thomas and Hannah having a cute little drink together. It's just a charming pair, no? Now, since you've all been trained by Colin, I expect no delays. Colin, I'd like a shot of the couple from the ground up, yes? Like a little mouse observing the scene. And then a handheld camera over there, like a curious passerby. I see what you're saying, but don't you think handheld cameras bring attention to the filmmaker? I thought we were going for a more invisible approach. Oh, I see, yes. Uh, you've had uh, half a day's training, and now you think you're an expert. <sighs> I led the training. This is cutting edge reality TV, Colin. I'll have nothing invisible about it. Well, surely you're meant to be focusing on the couple? Hmm. I'm a professional, Colin. I know what I'm doing. And so do I. Colin Simmons? Can I remind you that you work for me? I own you, yes? 
So I don't think you can strut around here directing the director. Then why did you hire me? Seems like you can do everything yourself anyway. A director cannot be a cinematographer, Colin. We don't have the time. Now, I will not have my vision blurred by your flawed decision making. My flawed decision making? I'm the only one on this set that has any real experience. I'm the cinematographer. That means I'm in charge of camera, light and sound. This is my vision, yes? Without me, you would not be here. So just, just shut up. Just shut up, okay? And make my vision. Your vision can get to fuck. Excuse me. Reality cannot be filmed. The very idea of putting a camera in front of something changes its reality. Colin, come here and listen. I know these are your first few days on set, and things may be a little confusing. So I am going to be very clear. You have no say. You are here for me to make my vision. Your vision is unoriginal and boring like all the others that have been introduced before. My vision will be studied by filmmakers for decades. Are you kidding yourself? Red TV is just there to make money. I can assure you I'm not doing this for the money. I'm only taking 80% of the profits. I'm making a sacrifice, Colin. 80%? That's absurd. I mean, that's besides the point. Look, reality TV is ruining our conception of real life. Kids are growing up thinking it's okay to have sex with whoever they want, to drink as much as they want, to have affairs. Oh, please, we're not making the Geordie Shores. No, listen to what I'm saying to you. A camera is a gift. It can educate, inspire, bring hope to thousands across the world. Look, reality TV is just mindless entertainment. And that's fine until someone struts around calling it a vision. And what hurt, Colin? Look, Pierre, you're one of the most frustrating people I've ever met. But you're charismatic, fun, and full of energy. I know you'll make something worthwhile. No one's ever said anything quite that nice to me before. Pierre, um, look. You need to travel, do mountaineering, horse riding, anything. You've got an amazing crew here. You're wasting their talent. Look, it's been a great experience, but I'm gonna have to leave. What? Sorry, I'm gonna have to quit. Colin, no, you can't leave. I need you. Fine. Whatever. Never noticed you half the time anyway. What? Colin! Promise you'll Skype every week! Hi Pierre, I mean, where are you? I've really got to go, I've got a new job today. You will not believe where we are. I've managed to find signal in the heart of the Peruvian rainforest. Where? What the hell are you doing there? Well, I've thought a lot about what you said about uh, filming reality, seeing the world, changing my life, etc, etc. And uh, I distinctly remember you said nothing about filming animals, so? I'm now filming animals. Okay, well, I'm, I'm happy for you. Colin, 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 right? I've caught a spider. Oh, Jesus oh, good. Put that oh. fucking spider down. Oh, goodness, what are you doing? Ah, get oh. away from me! Oh my god! All having fun, as you can see. Colin, Colin, they dragged me into the middle of nowhere, and there are snakes and there are spiders and, yeah. and, and monkeys. Oh, it's horrible. Yes. Sally, calm down. It's, it's gonna be all right, okay? You're having, you're having a great experience, but please, just make sure you bring that pair alive. Okay, all right, I can do it. Yes. Thanks. Good luck with your new job. Oh, Colin, I really 
do feel like I found my calling out here in the jungle. Oh, I tell you, animals are so much easier to direct than people. Hey. Well, I'm really glad you found something you love, but I mean, I've really got to go. But I look forward to seeing the video when it comes out. Have fun. Oh, I'm sure you are, yes. Get the snake away Goodbye. from me! Goodbye, cheerio! Away. Take care of yourself! Yeah. We miss you! Goodbye! Bye! Bye! I miss you, Colin! Bye! <laughs>